you have been exercising, you have been on a diet plan, pounds after pounds are falling off, you could slip yourself into better fitting pants, you were pleased. But out of a sudden, you are stuck, you stop losing weight, you have reached a point called a weight loss plateau. Today, we will share with you some simple tips to overcome a weight loss plateau. Make sure you watch till the end so that you have all the necessary tips you need to break through a weight loss plateau. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more tips like this and turn on the notification so that you don't miss our videos. Now, let's get straight into the video. Weight loss plateau is common for anyone on a weight loss program. This happens because your body adjusts to the new lower calorie norm and needs less calories than before for the same physical activity. Yes, it's frustrating. The good news is, there are simple ways to overcome the challenge and here are the top strategies. Number one, track what you eat. You felt you haven't been eating much for quite some time, but you are puzzled that your weight has not improved. The fact is that many people often underestimate how much calories we consume. So, it is important to track your intake of calories, protein, fat, and carbs. There are many mobile apps available to assist you. With the useful information, it allows you to modify your diet where necessary to lose weight. Number two, plan your meal. Failing to plan will lead to failure. So, it is important to plan your meals and your grocery shopping list accordingly. It may look time consuming, but it will save you a lot of time in the kitchen. Keep it fun and try new recipes. You can also invite like-minded friends on specific time of the week to plan your meals together. Number three, avoid skipping meals. Many people have the wrong thinking that skipping a meal is a workable solution for weight loss, but this is not true. Skipping a meal can slow your metabolism. You may be left feeling so hungry that you overeat. This stalls your progress in weight loss. Besides skipping a meal, undereating can affect your weight loss effort. It sends your body into starvation mode and that slows your metabolic rate. This affects your weight loss efforts and you will need time to rebuild your metabolic rate. So, you need to eat regularly to lose weight. Choose a combination of good carbohydrates, proteins and fats to help you burn calories consistently and prevent a derailing hunger. Number four, consume more fiber. Increase the amount of fiber in your diet can help you lose more weight. All types of fiber can aid weight loss, but soluble fiber in particular is more effective. Soluble fiber draws water from your gut. This slows your digestive process to keep you feeling satisfied and full longer. It also reduces your appetite and hence the amount of calories you consume. Soluble fiber includes black beans, lima beans, kidney beans, Brussels sprouts, broccoli, figs, and apricots. Number five, eat more good carbs. It may surprise you to see these tips on the list, but carbohydrates aren't necessarily bad. Yes, refined carbohydrates such as sugar, white bread, white rice, pastries, and sodas should not have a place in your dietary plan. But good unrefined carbohydrates are packed with fiber and nutrients. They include vegetables, fruits, legumes, and whole grains. You can eat a lot more of these good carbohydrates without worrying about calories and fats. They keep you feeling full longer and avoid the temptations of snacks. Number six, take more protein. Increased protein intake may help you lose more weight. Protein has the effect on boosting your metabolism. It burns more than twice as much calories compared to that from fat or carbohydrates. Proteins promotes the production of hormones to give you the feeling of fullness. High protein intake can protect you from losing your muscle mass, which normally happens during weight loss. When it comes to protein, it is equally important to consume them in smaller portions throughout the day. Number seven, consume fruits and vegetables at every meal. Fruits and vegetables are perfect weight loss ingredients. They are low in calories and fat, but rich in fiber, nutrients, and good carbohydrates. Studies show that diets with lots of fruits and vegetables produce the best weight loss result, but most people do not consume sufficient quantities of this weight loss friendly food. 
having fruits and vegetables in every meal will certainly help you to overcome a weight loss plateau. Number eight, drink more water. Proper hydration is often overlooked in most weight loss plans. Drink more plain water during the day can help you boost your metabolism. As a result, you burn more calories at rest and during activities. In addition, it keeps hunger at bay. Drink half a liter of water 30 minutes before meals can help you fill up your stomach to curb calories intake during meals. A study found that those who drank water before meal lost at least 40% more weight than those who didn't in 12 weeks. Number 9. Drink more coffee and tea. Coffee and tea may help in your weight loss effort. They contain caffeine. Caffeine is known to boost your metabolic rate and the fat burning effects of exercise but they must be consumed without sugar. Number 10. Avoid alcohol. Alcohol can sabotage your weight loss efforts. Alcoholic beverages contain much calories with no nutritional value. After drinking, most people tend to make the wrong dietary choices. Alcohol suppresses your body from burning fat and can lead to a build-up of belly fat and weight gain. Hence, alcohol must be avoided as much as possible to achieve your weight loss results. Number 11. Vary your cardio workout. Our bodies know how to adapt. If we continue the same set of regular exercises, they learn how to consume less calories to complete the exercises. The workout becomes less effective for weight loss. Vary your workout. Try to adopt a wide range of activities like cycling, jogging, hiking, or playing different racket sports. If doing different types of sports is not for you, you can vary the intervals and intensity of your normal workout. Number 12. Lift heavier weights. Weight loss plateau may indicate that your body is not being challenged with your current weight training workout. Sticking to the same weightlifting routine for too long could lower metabolism. This could mean the need to modify your training. Change the intensity, movements, and rest breaks can increase your body's capacity to burn fat. The more lean muscle mass you have, the more fat and calories you burn during rest. Hence, confusing your muscle tissue to varying your weight training program is the key to success. Number 13. Raise body movements. While you may visit the gym regularly, you can add extra activities in your day to burn more calories. For example, take stairs instead of elevator, walk around during breaks instead of sitting at your desk. Yes. Every single effort counts to get the scale moving again. Number 14. Get sufficient sleep. Sleep is important to maintain a good physical, mental, and emotional health. Studies have found that insufficient sleep can lower your metabolic rate and change your hormones level to drive hunger and fat storage. This leads to weight gain. In fact, not getting enough sleep could be the cause of store weight loss. Number 15. Manage your stress level. Stress could affect your weight loss effort. Chronic stress changes the level of hormone and cortisol. It is found that high cortisol levels are related to weight gain and obesity. If you are struggling in managing stress, meditation is a great way to calm your mind. Number 16. Don't just focus on weight. While hopping onto the weighing scale could be your daily routine, it is crucial to know that relying on weighing scale alone does not reflect your true progress. More importantly, you should also pay attention to your weight composition. Focus on fat loss rather than weight loss. If you have regular workout, you could be losing fat while building muscle, but your weight maintains. You could also be retaining more water because of your dietary habits. Instead of relying solely on your weighing scale to gauge your progress, you could assess by measuring your weight on a monthly basis. It keeps you motivated when you seem to have stopped losing weight at the moment. In summary, it can be demotivating and frustrating when you face weight loss plateau. It is important to recognize that it is normal part of the process. In fact, anybody would experience stall in their weight loss progress at some point in time. The right combination of dietary and workout plan coupled with the right mindset will go a long way to achieving breakthrough in weight loss plateau. Try all of a combination of the tips in this video. Inevitably, discipline plays a big part in your success. If you need further support, contact a doctor or nutritionist to receive further personalized advice. If you like this video, 
click the like button, subscribe and turn on the notifications so that you don't miss more videos on how to lose weight, improve health and build muscle. I will see you in the next video and take care.